On Saturday, November 9th, the Appalachian Wireless Arena hosted their first Country Roads Card and Trade Show. Sports and trading card enthusiasts were able to take a look at local shop stock and learn more about the businesses supporting the retro card market. Thanks to the positive reception, the arena will likely host another trade show in the near future. A lot of people said they enjoyed it, they loved it. Um, a lot to see, a lot to uh, a lot of different collectors. Had some very rare cards here. Had a 1953 Hank Aaron card that is very, very rare. You had a Babe Ruth card that was a little over $12,000. So, I mean, there was some high dollar cards here, very rare cards. Um, people love the tournaments. They love the trade night. Uh, a lot of people on social media were talking about can't wait until the next one. So, And hopefully we'll, we'll get together here with, uh, with Joe and uh, figure out a date and see when we can come out and get the next one going. You've been asking for it and now it's here. A better way to control your cellular plan with no credit check, no contracts, and most features of postpaid. Plus lots of new multi-month options and plans. It's the brand new Advanced Pay because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. The Appalachian Wireless Arena was happy to partner with local sellers for the event. Fans of competitive card games were also given space for tournament play and a chance to go home with high dollar prizes. It's good. It's good to have that relationship with them, uh, to get uh, the the name behind their brand, if you will. And uh, they, uh, they're they great to deal with, and they're just wanting to, uh, to get their stuff out, too. So it's great. We had one, two, three, over 20 tables just upstairs with people. And we had four chairs at each table. So it was constantly something going on all at, as soon as it started at 12 o'clock, the, the tournaments. So it just kept going all day. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.